Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I want to show you how to use Blue Devil on a Mustang. This is a 2004 Mustang V6, and we had a little problem. We had a little smoke coming out of the driver's side, and I feel like the driver's side head gasket was bad. So, I'm going to show you quickly and efficiently how to use the $60 big bottle of Blue Devil on your car and make it work for your application the best. Now, this is how I did it and it worked the best for me, so I'm going to show you. I removed the upper radiator hose and I removed the lower radiator hose. I pushed the lower down here. I pulled this up, I started the car, and I got a hose, a garden hose, and stuck it in here and watched to keep the belt away, the hose away from the belt. I pulled it way up here and I I twisted the garden hose in my hand like this to shut the pressure off and then I held it up here and I had this up and I flushed it through there with the car running and then I had an assistant, my boy, looking at the water down there at the bottom. We flushed it for about 20 minutes till it came crystal clear water. You have to do this. The stuff doesn't cure to the motor. The, the uh, coolant will not allow it to stick. You have to flush this motor. You have to flush this radiator out till it's crystal clear water. And I suggest you do it twice just to be sure. Because you don't want to waste your $60 investment on that big bottle of Blue Devil you just bought. You'll be pissed. So, after you flush this out, it comes cool water to here. <clears throat> Then I go ahead and I flush the radiator. And how I flush the radiator is, I pull the cap off, I put um, the faucet in there, it starts coming out here. Um, before I reattach this hose, I stick the hose in here, and I let it come out the other way too, as well. So that way I'm getting both sides of the radiator. I do this twice to make sure it's crystal clear. Now, the Blue Devil instructions say run it for an hour and pour it in slowly. And the block has to be completely filled with water, and the radiator has to be maybe at three quarters of the way so you can add your Blue Devil. Now, when I was adding my Blue Devil, I'm going to tell you a trick that will work better for you. If you fill it up all the way and you go to add your Blue Devil and pour it in slowly, it will start coming out and we were throwing the cap on and turning it when it was starting to come out. But I think you leave the radiator a little bit less full and then you pour it in slowly and then after you're done adding that, then you add the rest in water until you get it full and then put the cap on. I think that's the better way so most of the solution stays in the car. After that, you're supposed to warm the car up for one hour. Ours had a problem. After 30 minutes, we were reaching a hot sign, and I was worried this wasn't working. So, we turned the car off, and we completed the heat cycle again for another 30 minutes. And then, after that 30 minutes, 